being mad at the track and to what degree is it just a hard track to run with the Acura and or that my tune specifically is like the gearing is not you know good for it yeah since it's uh one of these guys in the back is afk so i just crashed in the back one so oh. not much wonderful all right anyways <clears throat> yeah so i figured just bass audio tune i know it's supposed to be pretty fast and it's supposed to be good at this track so yeah you know if i do bad and then it's just purely a skill issue <laughs> What do you do when anyone does? Explain the game. Yeah. Granted, I don't, I don't drive the Audi enough to consistently be able to drive it the same every time. Yeah. But it's like, because it, it, it is basically like the second hardest to drive, but it's, it's, it, it depends, right? Because like. Oh, Acura, big rack back there. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck. The Acura is supposed to be. I, I've been told it's the hardest. Lots of people trying to say it's Acura or the Audi, and I think I think really it, I think they're both like equally as hard, but like in slightly different ways. Yeah. And I'm used to the way the Acura's hard. I'm a little bit less used to the way that the Audi's hard. So just because of that, I think I'm more likely to make like a a bigger spin-out mistake, which is what I gotta try to avoid. Well, the Audi, as much as I like it, it, it's too free, you know, it's too loose of a car for me. I want something with more control. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, I just slowed down on that turn, like, massively, and I didn't need to. Yeah, I, I didn't take that slight turn well. I let a guy pass me. Yeah, so the barriers on this track, though, lot the problem with them is lots of them are, like, really high, like, right on the edge. So if yeah. you're on them, it's not like they're necessarily terrible. But as you're entering to get onto them, like, sometimes you just bounce off them. Yeah. Like, you get, like, stuck on it weird, and then they're bad. <laughs> like... <laughs> on the Audi, that's another yeah, thing. Yeah, yeah. If the steering wasn't bad enough, it also just doesn't have brakes. Oh my gosh. And uh, the, the first lap, no brakes, not an issue. Second lap, all of a sudden I'm like missing every turn by like a lot. Yeah. God damn it, people keep fucking bumping me up here. I'm losing so many spots just to aggressive drivers. This guy missed a slight turn. Oh, I got caught up in him. God damn it. Fucking idiot. I'm losing so many fucking positions in this race. Dude. Oh my gosh, bro. I was I was in the grass. I got all messed up. Um, but I don't know what just happened. I literally lost all my momentum. Like I was going hundreds of miles an hour, going straight in the grass, and then yeah. all of a sudden my car decelerated to like 50 miles an hour. Without really doing
you make one slight mistake like I did, I lost seven positions. I gained like like six or seven positions and then I lost like six or seven positions. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I tried to do the reverse swoop, but it didn't work. Consistently messed up that very slight turn. So I'm, I'm trying to take it with like actually just not breaking. <laughs> That's, it's very that. difficult. Corvette is the best car to do that, and even then it's difficult. Although I feel I think the BMW can take it really well too. No one pit yet, and I think everyone's pitting this lap. Maybe I should I should start trying the Viper more. So that's another car that's that's really good. And I think um, in terms of like brakes and handling, it's a bit just easier to control. And like it when it comes to brakes, it doesn't have anything obviously wrong with it. Yeah. So it feels I think it feels actually a little bit like the the Corvette, I guess. Um, not quite, but. Everyone's going in. To be expected. Make sure you remember the tires. Yeah. Remember the tires. God, it's gonna be good. Be kidding me, man.
Hey, just in the center of the Ah. He probably tried in jo uh, joining your party, and then you didn't say anything. I didn't. Oh, wait, I'm, I'm not in the party because I left it. Yeah. Well, we can't really stop and tell him we're in Discord for another five minutes or so. Yeah. really bad race for me too, but I mean it was kind of to be expected. Well it's I like I'm not making <laughs> that many mistakes, it's just I'm not fast right now. That That's what it is. I'm not the fastest car out there. And it really sucks, because I'm usually up there. But whatever I'm doing is just not completely on, like, I'm just completely failing. That's, that's my only thought. I haven't even gone off the track once, and I'm just not, I'm just not racing low right now. Yeah. Did I just run out of gas? No. Oh, my game just like... You gotta be kidding me. My game just like clicked out of it or something, and like, I lost control for a, oh. for a while. Your game just like all tabbed itself or something? I got, I got like a bunch of like alerts popped up on like Windows or something, and like unfocus the window for some reason. Oh, yeah. I don't know. The guy in front of me, it just keeps pulling ahead more and more seconds. He's full 12 seconds ahead now. So, like, I don't think I'm catching up to him. Yeah. I keep screwing up the same turn. Like the rest of the track, I'm getting perfect. I was six seconds ahead, but that's because he wiped out. Even the person behind me is gaining on me slightly, but it's there. I just keep getting passed. The guy in front of me does a 4.4 second penalty time, though, so I'll get his spot for that. A lot of people running the Mercedes, and it seems pretty fast. Yeah. Based on the last race, it seemed like it was really good. I mean, they're good in reality. Mercedes, AMGs, those are some fast cars. Dang, I said a 209.3 just now on medium tires. Nice. Wait, is that good or bad? That was really good. 209.3, I would qualify top five. I got a solid uh, 214 as my best time. Ouch. You gotta practice more on this track then. The one the one thing I like about this track is, got its, is that it has just about every turn possible in the game. You know, it's got the oh, weird yeah. angles, it's got the carousel, it's got the slight turn. Yeah. A couple slight turns. I got turns. a 214.061 now. Even better. By like nice. 3 point something seconds. 0.3 something seconds. Oh, a big wipeout on the sand turn. 2 Mercedes just wipe each other out. So, when I was doing the Acura though, I had gotten a 2 like 11 or something, I think. Yeah. So, I still technically did a lot better with the Acura.
Yeah, like I just took a turn better than the Mercedes, and this thing, this thing's just running away from me. Yeah. <clears throat> I was able to hold off one of them, but seventh is all I got. I mean, the guy who won gained 17 spots. <laughs> nice. Right, there's still someone behind me, so I'm not technically last. Also, I got about a second faster on last lap. Yeah. Bloop. Wow, that should that be like a 13 something. RBM Wesley guy, his his best lap was at 203.9. I think that's the lowest I've ever seen. Alright, um... Yeah, we can quit Aloha. out Justin. Justine. Me and, um... Uh, John are in Discord because we were having issues with the Xbox party chat. Can you hear but, him in there? Uh, you down to play right now? Play some Forza? If you can't hear him, then the problem is on your end. I can hear him so far. Okay. Nice work out there. Um, is there a way for Justin to join Discord on his Xbox, John? Yeah. He says yes. Uh. I forget exactly how, but there's a way to integrate. They integrated it into like Xbox Party. And then there's like an option that just says Discord, and then you basically just scan a code, uh, and then it'll connect to your phone, and then it'll list all of the servers that you're in, and you can basically join any voice channel within those servers that you have access to. Okay. 